Good evening, Britain. Uh, and what I'm about to try and do, hopefully, David Williams is going to save my life. David, can I invite you to come and join me on the stage? Ladies and gentlemen, David Williams. Hi. Hello, David. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm really good, thank you. Right. Have a seat here, thank sir. Thank you. What I'd love you to do, first of all, is to check out this uh, blindfold. It's made of one piece of metal. The reason I bought you guys a metal blindfold is I really want to impress upon you that you can't see through it, but don't take my word for it. I've had a lot of experience with blindfolds, so let me just... <laughs> So you definitely can't see. It's good, right? Can't see okay, good. You can take it off. I'll get it from you in a second. Now, the inspiration for what I'm going to try and do uh, comes from a game that I play with my daughter, uh, Millie. She's six, and it's basically like a version of chicken, okay? And we can play it right now. Okay. Uh, so I've got a cup, and what I'd like you to do is I'd like to hold it. I'd like you to hold it on the top of your head. You've played this game before. Uh, uh, I've got some water, and I'm going to pour the water into the cup and just by listening to the sound of it, I want you to shout stop when you think the cup is absolutely <laughs> full. Ready? Yeah. Stop. <laughs> It's really good. Not bad. And obviously, the worst thing that's going to happen if you get that wrong, you're going to get a bit wet. Well, tonight I'm going to play exactly the same game, but the stakes are just a little bit higher. David, if I can ask Thank you, you very to go much. to a safe place. Thank you, Bianca. This is a loaded crossbow. I also have uh, a balloon, natural enemy of a crossbow. Uh, this bow shoots at 120 feet per second, which means that at this distance, this arrow will hit that balloon faster than you can blink your eye. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Bianca. She's amazing. Thank you. Now, I've got some more crossbows. They're the same, they're identical, but this time they're on stands, uh, and underneath them, there are containers of water. Underneath the containers are taps. So when we open the taps, the water will flow down into the bottles that are underneath. The bottles are attached to the triggers of the crossbows. Different size bottles means that the bows are going to fire at different times. Straight into this target, which is where I'm going to be standing. I have to listen to the sound of the water flowing, exactly like you did, David, and get out of the way. This is blindfold chicken with crossbows. If I can ask you guys for absolute silence. Bianca, turn on the tap. We need reinforcing how dangerous that was. Let's a take look. a look at this. Take a look at this in slow motion. Have a look at this. This is what's just happened. This is him. No! 
And then, of course, the end arrow. Yikes! Wow! Wow, wow, wow. Um, you mad man. Well then, Jonathan, the most dangerous act we've ever had, Simon, would you agree? I mean, look, part of me is thinking, I don't want you in the finals. <laughs> <laughs> it's too stressful. Yes. Genuinely, I mean, uh, you know, I hadn't seen this in rehearsals. If I had, I would have said, you're nuts, don't do it. Honestly, I would have done. So, respect. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> what I mean is... It's, it, apart from it being obviously incredibly dangerous, and I had an incredible view of that, it's also so inventive. I mean, how'd you come up with things, taps and things and crossbows and everything? Um, absolutely brilliant. I have this lovely magic memento of our time together. <laughs> I know someone would have liked it to have been my real face, wouldn't they? <laughs> well done, Jonathan. I mean, you're just, you're crazy, but absolute genius at the same time. It was, I, it was so hard to watch. And I don't normally like this kind of act, but I like you. Fantastic. It's, it's compelling, isn't it? It's compelling, yeah, It's one of those things yes. where you can't stop <laughs> watching. You don't want to. I think it's the first time we were both trembling together. Like, oh, it was fabulous, Thank you. terrifying. I would love to see an act like this win the entire thing and be on the Royal Variety, because I'd love to see the Royal oh. Family's reaction to it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, judges. Jonathan. The thing is, as well, is you didn't even take precaution. You've got the flimsiest vest I've ever seen on. <laughs> At least put something that's going to deflect them put or something. Put leather on or something. Um, how does it feel up there? I was bricking it, honestly. Uh -huh. I really was. And, and on, obviously this is, you know, biggest TV show in, in the UK, and, and I wasn't really even nervous about that. It was just that. It is easily the most dangerous thing I've ever done. And, and you said it came about as an idea of a game you played with your daughter. Did you tell her where that game had led and what you were going to do? A, a hundred percent. Do you know what? Millie was there the very first time I ever tried this. Go away. And, and she was giggling the whole time. She loved it. <laughs> We've seen some scary stuff on this show, but that, I mean, that, that is the top. Oh, well excellent. Done. Thank well you. Done, excellent. <laughs> excellent. It's crazy. It's amazing. Yeah. And if you think Jonathan deserves a place in Sunday's final, you can vote for him in just a moment. Give it up one more time, though. Jonathan Goodwin, everybody.